Hi, this is Pat Love with Pat's Two Cents, reading one snippet from Psalms 33, only the verses 10 and 11, and followed by Pat's Two Cents. Now listen to this, because many of you are really going through. The Lord bringeth the counsel of the heathen to naught. He maketh the devices of the people of none effect. The counsel of the Lord standeth forever. The thoughts of his heart to all generations. Listen, Pat's two cents now. You may feel like you have an enemy. You may feel like you have many enemies. But no matter what they rise up against you, no matter what they bring, what accusations they bring, against you whether they're lies or partial truths or whatever or total fabrications here is the thing you have to remember you know God is for you well if God is for you who can be against you that's a rhetorical question I know it hurts I know it's uncomfortable when people come against you. I'm not making light of that. What I'm trying to get you to see is how to look at it in the right perspective. This can be my problem. I've got to hold it where you can see pretty much the size where my face is. All right. Now, if you keep looking at the problem, and you keep looking and focusing at the problem. It gets bigger and bigger. The people coming against you seem to be humongous. The problem seems to be insurmountable. And you get to the point where it gets so big. It gets so big that you're so engulfed in the problem. You cannot see. You can't see God. You can't see around it. You can't see your way out of it. Change your focus. Move that thing out of your face. Look up to the hills from whence cometh your help. Psalms 121 says, I will look to the hills from whence cometh my help. My help cometh from the Lord. Since we're talking about Psalms 121, Guess what? Mama Sita's going to read it. Because I want you to hear through the right perspective. You hear me? All right, listen to this. Okay, let's see if I can get here. Here it is. (laughs) Finally. I will lift up mine eyes unto the hills from whence cometh my help. My help cometh from the Lord, which made heaven and earth. He will not suffer thy foot to be moved. He that keepeth thee will not slumber. (sighs) Behold, he that keepeth Israel shall neither slumber nor sleep. The Lord is thy keeper. The Lord is thy shade upon thy right hand. The sun shall not smite thee by day nor the moon by night the lord shall preserve thee from all evil he shall preserve thy soul the lord shall preserve thy going out and thy coming in from this time forth and even forevermore now pat's two cents you can take that to the bank and you don't have to worry about the check bouncing Do you hear me? You lift your head up high. You walk around as if nothing is going wrong. You ask God to put a smile in your heart where there are tears. You ask God to remove the hurt and fill the hurt with healing. Take out the hurt, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Take out all that hurt. Take the weight off your shoulders. It's too heavy. 
Let God carry it. And you skip along in the joy of the Lord. Because the joy of the Lord is your strength. I'll be back.